All right, everybody, Cutco Mike here. Reflection off the uh, two-quart Cutco five-ply uh, piece of cookware here. Real simple video. I wanna just teach you my favorite way to eat and make corn. There's so many different wonderful ways, but if you need corn quick and you wanna feed many guests or just yourself and your kids, we're gonna use the uh, Cutco two-quart here. And a lot of times people buy this cookware and they think, well, I want it to do my steaks or my eggs or my meat, but the number one selling point, in my opinion, is how your vegetables turn out. So most people either boil their vegetables to death or they nuke them in the microwave and they lose all that nutritional value. So this is a couple days old here, but um, obviously you can get corn anywhere. Uh, one other reason why I love using the cleaver is to cut my corn in half. So when you have kids to feed, you also need uh, more portions and... Um, it's actually another use for the cleaver. So if you have the ultimate set or the beast, and you're like, man, I never use that big knife in the middle, here's a little uh, way to use that big knife. So the cleaver is a great piece. So it's super thick, super heavy duty. You can also use this for like your ribs, your uh, pulled pork, your burn ends, and then um, coconut. So if you use the backside here for your coconut, you can use that to uh, go right on the seam of the coconut and crack that open. So with the cleaver, you just put it right there in the middle and just push down. I'm on my glass top here, so I probably shouldn't push down that hard. Um, actually, a little bit easier if you just kind of use the back uh, side of the blade there instead of push down. So just use the back side, you're good to go. And then um, here's what's cool. So you got your pot. We're gonna put them in here, literally line them up, take as much of that, uh, whatever you call it, cat hair, witch's hair off. And one of the good tips on the cookware is if you can load it up to full capacity. So a lot of people go, I only need one or two pots for everything. That one looks pretty beat up there. Looks like uh, some of your uh, toenails right now. All right, so all you're gonna need is a cup of water. See, most people, they either don't have the right cookware or they are microwaving it or boiling the crap out of their uh, vegetables. So you can literally load this up with broccoli. You can load it up with carrots. If, if you did carrots right now, you'd come out bright orange. But if you see, all I have is just a little bit of water on the bottom. We're going to put this on medium heat and then put the lid on. And then literally in about eight to ten minutes, this lid will perfectly be spinning and then when I take it off, all my vegetables, whatever I'm cooking, in this case, corn will be bright flavored, full of great taste, all the nutrients are restored, and literally, that's all I have is a cup of water. And I probably could have used less on this portion, but um, if you have Cutco cookware, you know this is one of the big selling points is how to do your vegetables. If you don't have Cutco cookware, I recommend reaching out or picking up a few of these um, little saucepans, but I'm not gonna keep you here for 10 minutes, hopefully that helped. What we did is we took the cleaver, cut our corn in half, a cup of water, and then at the end you can add butter or a little seasoning salt. So once again, the lid, once on, will cook from all sides. So it's literally cooking from five directions uh, with five layers of metal. Actually, four directions, five layers of metal. So these ways, top to bottom. All right, everybody, thanks for watching. If you have cut go and you've done this, Comment below. Talk to you soon. I'll post a picture of the finished product.